Hi everyone, it's Lauren with Talent Recap. We're here at NBC Universal for The Voice season 16 live performances. We're about to chat with the top 13 right now, so stay with us. Hi guys, it's Lauren with Talent Recap and I'm here with Team Kelly. Congratulations on making it to the top 13. That's pretty cool. Thank you so much. Thank you. How does it feel? Uh, it's incredible. I mean, I'm just I'm blessed to be here. I mean, there's so much talent. So so many talented folks have went home, and I'm just forever grateful, you know, for the folks that's voted me through. So I'm I'm thankful for that. Blessing to be here. Yeah. It's definitely pretty surreal, like what Rod said. Like there's so many talented people, and we started out with thousands of people who auditioned, and now we're down to the last 13 people, and it just feels very humbling to know that. And um, I'm just very grateful for America for voting me through. <laughs> Definitely. And I'm sure with Kelly, there's so many behind the scene moments because she is just, she's a hoot. So oh. tell me something that's happened this week or throughout the competition. Maybe a way she's made you laugh or inspired you. Uh, going over my song in rehearsal, I look over, I hear a crunch, and she has a nachos bel grande, <laughs> like right in, <laughs> right in the middle of rehearsal. So that would probably have to be, she's so down the earth. She is, she's incredible. We couldn't, we truly got, I believe, the best coach out there. Yeah. She's incredible. So, it, but there's a there's a lot of like moments like I was gonna say that exact same moment, but um, just kind of in general, like just Kelly um, makes you feel so much at home when you're in rehearsal, and she's very, she like treats you like she's a friend. She's not like a celebrity or someone that you have to look up to, and it's just so cool to see someone at that caliber and someone with that level of talent to even like go down and like treat you the same way. So it's just very cool. <laughs> She just had surgery on Thursday, is that right? Yeah, How did that yeah. affect your week and performances, rehearsal time? Everything just went smooth, you know, everything went smooth. So, uh, yeah, I know. I'm like, that's incredible. Yeah. Like, I, I'd have still been laid up in the bed hollering and screaming. I'm like, sorry, guys, can't make it. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I was going to say, I think she has superpowers because yeah. I, I swear to God, like, she literally looked like she didn't have anything going on. And um, she had all that stuff going on that week, too. And it's just so incredible that she went through all of that with what she was going through. So, yeah, Definitely. it's cool. Yeah. So tell me what's, you know, now we are two weeks away from finals, and I'm sure this has just gone in the blink of an eye for you guys. What has been, you know, the legacy really that you want to leave behind on this show? I mean, just show that I'm, I'm laying it out there every each and every week, you know, giving my all. And uh, that's really what I want to lay out there and, you know, allow people to say, hey, this guy's, you know, putting everything he's got in it. So hopefully America enjoys it and yeah. hopefully they'll vote. <laughs> I think the biggest thing for me is that I'm just very grateful for all the things that I've learned from my coach and I'm just very happy that I get on that stage and actually show my true authentic self um, with my music and actually learn something through learning that being perfect is okay but like not being perfect when you're singing live sometimes like that's even better because then you can show that you can really connect to the audience and that's something that i had to learn while i was on the show not thinking too much about what notes i'm hitting but actually feeling the words of the song and making it a little rough yeah. <laughs> so yeah i'm with you <laughs> easy to get in your head i'm sure oh, right de lord definitely i mean you're standing on a stage and millions of people's watching i mean so it's in your mind you're trying to sing you know you're wanting to know where am i going to be on the stage you know so choreography not much in my case, but you know. <laughs> but uh. Busts out the best moves. So. Oh yeah. I just don't show them on TV, you know. Yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm sure. I'm sure. And restrict myself, you know. I, I didn't want to show out too much, you know. <laughs> Anything you tell yourself before getting on stage, like a pep talk? Is there a phrase? Don't um, mess up. Yeah. <laughs> My, um, one of my best friends actually texted me before my performance and he was like, you know what could help? And just try it. Before you go on stage, just whisper to yourself multiple times, you're a diva. No. And so I was like, before I went on stage, I was like, you're a diva, you're a diva, you're a diva. It actually helped a lot. So weirdly that's enough. A, that's a Beyonce phrase, I so I think it works. I, I want you to say you're a diva next week and see how it goes. I'm a diva. I'm a diva. There you go. Uh, it's not working right now. <laughs> nice ring to it when you say it. It does. Diva. It's stretched out diva. Yeah, stretched out diva. Awesome, guys. Well, we're so looking forward yes, to seeing team. what happens, and good luck to you. Make sure you vote for Team Kelly. We're, we're Team, team Kelly, Kelly, and you're, you're watching, watching Talent Recap. Recap. Hi, I'm Talentino, Talent Recap's real favorite intern. If you like the stuff that we do with the funny and the talent and the ha ha and whatever, click below to subscribe. You'll never miss a thing. Ha 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 ha!